Hey, Sam R here, and welcome to VidBuilder FX. This is a new software that runs both on Windows and Mac, and it allows you to be able to curate video content to be able to create short viral videos to be able to use on Facebook. Now, what are the benefits of these videos before we get into uh, taking a look at it? The, you probably see a lot of short videos on Facebook that are either full of funny content or viral style content, but it also has uh, text down the bottom and things like this to be able to drive traffic to either your page or your web page. So this allows you to be able to create these videos. Now, also there's word going around that Facebook is going to start monetizing the videos on Facebook that organically get traction uh, get views so the people responsible for creating these videos are going to be able to monetize them like they do on YouTube. So this is going to make it super simple to be able to create nice, short, compelling, viral style videos for Facebook. So here we are right within the software and I'm going to show you how you, how easy it is to create one of these videos, how you can add uh, a, you know, some text to these videos to be able to customize it for you and also how you can export it or even upload it and schedule it into Facebook. So let's get to it. So we're going to create a demo. So we're going to call this, uh, we're going to call this the bonus demo. Okay. And we can choose whether to create a single video or multiple videos. Now on today, I'm just going to show you how to create a single video because the multiple video is the same process. It just allows you to create more than one video at once. Okay. So we click next. Now this is where we start to find videos. We can either import them from our computer if we already have video content, or we can curate it from the web. So if we just write in uh, silly cats, because cat videos are quite uh, popular, and we can choose how many clips we want to put in to be able to merge them into a video. So we're just gonna choose three for the sake of this demo, and we're gonna click begin. So there we go, it's found some videos and it's uh, put in little clips up here for the thumbnails of them. So if we click on it, it shows it in the preview video. Now, if this video is, you know, what we what we want to use, um, we can just watch it and see if it's suitable for what we're after. If it isn't, we just click the refresh button up here and it'll find a new video. Same with the other ones in the, in the queue. It will find uh, more and more for us as well. Okay, so here we go. We can see that these videos are suitable. Now, for the uh, the time off the clip, uh, we can have it, you know, up to a certain amount of seconds uh, per clip, and it's going to make a video and put it all together. So if we make it five seconds per clip of these uh, cats doing silly things, uh, it will stitch together a 15 second clip. Now, where it starts to get really, really interesting is here in the text. You've probably seen it, especially on a lot of meme pages or viral content pages. Under the videos, they have text. So we can say, check out our cat toys at Sam's cat toys dot com. Okay. <coughs> So what we can do is we can add these into underneath the video. Now we can also, uh, this is perfect if you have an e-com store or something like that and the video goes viral, gets thousands of views, uh, you know, possibly hundreds of thousands of views depending how it is. Uh, you can add in a link to your website so people can search it up. You can also uh, say, follow our Facebook page, Sam's Cat Toys, you know, uh, whatever we want to put down there. Okay, so we can put whatever we want down here as a call to action for our customers. Now, uh, for the people that are viewing this video, we can choose the text color, we can fully customize it, we can change the font size to be even bigger. Okay, uh, we can change the, the font to be whatever font we want as well. And we can even change the background color of what the text goes on. So we can make it pink if we want to, you know. Uh, we can have the text uh, at the top or at the bottom. And so that's how we customize the video. Now we can ch customize the transition. So when it shifts through the video, uh, if it just moves them out of the right, moves them, you know, various ways. And of course, for this video, we can either have the native sound of the video, and I'll show you how to mute that soon, or we can uh, add in some music that from the library that's already built in. We can also import our own MP3, uh, MP3 file for music as well, or you can do te text to, tick to speech. 
uh, text to speech where we write in uh, a script for it to go over. It may say like, hey, check out our website. And then you put in demo website com and it will um, make a voice recording uh, you know in a voice to be able to go over the top of that sort of generic computery sounding voice okay so it might ha uh, might be useful so for some of you you can even download you can even record your own voice and put an mp3 in to put over the top of the video now you can also have an intro and outro uh, with uh, images as well uh, depending what you want so if we enable the intro and outro you can add in a slide image for the start uh, you can add in text as well so it has something before the video even starts and you can fully customize that with the colors and things too so there's lots to play around with here I'm sure you can tell okay so now uh, as a as a project we can save our project now what we can do is we can either export the video as an mp4 as you can see you can choose a whole bunch of different sizes uh, you can choose the quality as well and you can just uh, where I talked about muting the native audio on the video you click mute audio just so it has your music or your voiceover but if you're happy with the the, the current sound in the video you just uh, leave it as there and we can export the video as an mp4 okay the other thing you can do is you can schedule to publish it okay so once you've uh, so once you've exported it you just find the file on your computer uh, you can put in the post uh, the post description and then what you can do is you can either uh, choose your personal profile or Facebook pages and things if you have those available. Okay, what you can do is you choose a time for it to go out, a uh, date and a time, and you simply click schedule now and that'll schedule it in. Or if you want to publish it right now, you hit publish. Okay, so it is that simple to be able to create these uh, these sorts of viral sorts of videos that you're seeing on Facebook with Vid Builder FX. Perfect for those of you uh, looking to be able to direct traffic using viral video on Facebook or looking to uh, create videos that get a lot of views and uh, when Facebook does the monetization thing, start earning money off it as well. Uh, especially good if you don't have your own content, you're able to curate content online using this tool so i hope if this is what you're after for your business this has been a nice little demo for you check everything out down below see the bonuses get the early bird details and get in as soon as you can this is sam and we'll talk again soon